Our guy, Felipe Esparza, yes. who's currently Felipe. smelling himself right now, checking his armpits, I think. Felipe Esparza's back on the cruise show. Let's What's go. up, fool? I was smelling so myself. I was doing my little move from Isa Morales and, and Blood and, Blood and um, La Bamba. What La Bamba. Like <laughs> Vampiro. <laughs> Vampiro with the leather jacket. I didn't beer from his mom. That's yeah. right. That's right. That's right. What's up, fool? The podcast doing well. That's Congratulations. Really awesome, bro. You haven't had any of us on, but okay. We're still a fan of the podcast. We have a, a strict contract here, bro. <laughs> We gotta be celebrities to be interviewed. (laughs) I've seen you a lot, bro. I've seen you here, seen you at the other place, at the parade. East LA Parade, we had a good time out there. I think I got high, I got hired, and nobody told me. Wait, (laughs) what happened? What happened? I've seen you everywhere, bro. I must have got hired when I was high and forgot I I signed up for free. (laughs) In the morning, I was walking around with a a full time intern. Uh Bullhorn. And he was just like yelling at people. I was yelling at people, bro. I was yelling yelling everything. What's up, fool? Yeah, yeah. I saw a bunch of people, you know. I said, hey, arreglen sus papeles, por favor. Uh Uh Pretty much telling them. Get your papers together. If you, don't, right. if you need help, ask a friend. That's yeah, right. That's, that's right. Good. I honestly thought one they of us would see too. some family out there, too. Like, yo, that's my cousin yeah. right there. You know, because we're Raza. We're everywhere, bro. Yeah, man. It's funny. I, I, some woman ran up to me, right? Yeah. She goes, hey, my son and Frank Castillo, you should invite him. And she, he goes, but that guy's a comedian, right? Yeah. His mom ran up to me, bro, and told me I should invite him to the parade. But I knew that he was in D.C. working with, with um, Polly Shore. Yeah. Right, but she didn't know that, right? But that's crazy how your moms all mm-hmm. want you to be somebody and shit. <laughs> right, right. Support right. you and shit. <laughs> Walking up to you and you're like trying to hop on your floor. Hey, Cruz. My <laughs> hijo, hey, he could be a DJ, man. <laughs> co-sign for him. Yeah. Who's <laughs> don't know, man? You cannot co-sign fame, all right? Right, 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 right. Like my dad, Sparza. when I first met Paul Rodriguez, my dad said, hey, mijo. Wow. Que te pongo un cosign. Uh-huh. For what? Para que te hagas famoso. <laughs> you can't cosign fame, Dad. Only jobs. Yeah. Only jobs. <laughs> exactly. And houses. And houses. And cars. I, I don't know about houses, man. You'll be on that show. Um, 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 that show about greedy people, eh? Oh, right, right, right. American, American greed. greed. Oh, I love that show. I love that show, man, because God, you I realize it. that it's not the, per- the the person who robbed you wasn't the greedy person. It no. was you. It was you. It was you yep. all along. He just put it out there. He put the cheese. You went to go mm-hmm. grab it. And you grabbed it. Like so. you gave him a thousand you gave him a four hundred this old man in Pobrecito, man. I lost four hundred thousand dollars. <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna do now, right, man. Right. <laughs> You go, Mexican, we don't lose money like that, bro. We lose money with condinas. Uh-huh. Right, right, right. Let's what you know about that, my G. Uh, my mom, my, my mom. mom got one going right raffle now. With my ticket. My mom. Yeah, leader, raffle bro. ticket. <laughs> Yo, hey, have you ever draft. been somewhere? You know, uh, your comedy has made you travel around the world, right? Yeah, man. Have you ever been somewhere and surprised to see a Latino? Everywhere I go. Yeah. <laughs> really? Well, yeah, actually, when I went to Tampa, Florida, there were a lot of Latinos there. Mm-hmm. Most of them were Mexican, but they're from Texas. That's right. And now, uh, why mama? Why Mama, Texas? Uh huh. Why Mama? And Dover, why? Dover. Uh-huh. I'm sorry. Why Mama, Florida? Uh-huh. Dover, Florida. Right, 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 right. Latinos there. A lot, man. Yeah. A lot. They even got taco stands and everything. Oh, bro. okay. We're and, a, and, a, and, a, and also a, a little, a little crazy. Like Miami too. Mm-hmm. There's a section now with a lot of taco trucks, bro. Mm, Mexican taco trucks? Yeah, Mexican taco trucks. I wonder trucks. how the Cubans feel about that out there. Man. I don't know, man. There's still a lot of Cuban food everywhere, bro. Absolutely. Yeah. Everywhere, They're not going to anytime soon out there. I didn't even know that. I went to the Cuban restaurant, man, that had everything, bro. It was like being at Grand Central Market, you know, oh, where they have yeah, all uh-huh. kinds of meat, but they had lechon Simon. and all kinds of stuff. They even had Chinese food. Really? Wow. Yo, are you a vegan? You're a vegan, right? Yeah, people don't believe me, but it's all good. I know, right? I'm a vegetarian. I don't look it, bro. It's all good, my G. How long have you been a vegan, and why? 2011, because, um, I don't know, man, I got tired of eating um, meat. I was on a cr- this crazy diet, of course. And sure. I got sick. I got constipated, and I, got, I had the runs and all that. So you know what? I'm not going to eat meat no more and cheese. Wow. Mm-hmm. But I started off slow, though. First, I started off with no milk. No milk and Got no it. cheese. Yeah, no uh-huh. dairy, sure. And then I moved to meat. You feel better about it? Feel I good? think I do. I don't get a heartburn as much. Yeah, or like I don't get constipated. Or, I don't get hemorrhoids yeah. as much. Right. Uh-huh. I don't got to push meat out, bro. I've like, never had a hemorrhoid. I fear. I you're fear lucky, bro. When a man has a hemorrhoid, it's like he lost his virginity, bro. Yeah. Uh-huh. Do me a favor. Again. Describe a hemorrhoid to DJ yeah. Leslie in like six words. Yeah, I don't know what a hemorrhoid less. is. A hemorrhoid, bro, is, is like if you ever have a woman who has birth, I could tell you that. Mm-hmm. You know, you get a... Because you're, you're pushing stuff out. Yeah, you know it's supposed to come out naturally. That's when something's right. supposed to come out of your body naturally, let it come out naturally. If you don't, you know you're pushing too hard and you're yeah. breaking um, blood vessels in your mm. colon. Yeah, yeah, and yeah. that stuff comes like a little pimple. 
that doesn't really pop. It just stays there, bro, like a little punching bag, bro. Oh, and every time you, every time you touch it, coming out of your every butt. time you touch it, bro, Damn. it feels like you're being raped in prison, bro. Wow, by a man. That's crazy. Who do they want you? To... So how do you pop it? How do you get rid you of it? You don't pop it, no, man. Don't pop you just it. let don't it go. Like Rub preparation H uh -huh. or something on it, or don't leave it alone, or stop eating and don't. Or take sleep with your legs up, life. man. Do something. Sleep with your legs up. Yeah, Garcia always says every time I said, man, I gotta go to the bathroom. He's like, bro, don't push. Don't, don't push, because push, that's how you get hemorrhoids. No, man, do not push. That makes it bad, too? Yeah, when you sit too long on the toilet. Uh, yeah, man, I've been kind of, forgetting. Also, truck drivers get it. You got a hemorrhoid coming your way, my G. I already yeah. had one. You never nah, had a hemorrhoid. Did you check all your important it. emails on the toilet? What happened? I said, is that where you check all your important For emails? For real. Microsoft yeah. Theater, Friday, October 4th. Tickets on sale right now. The Microsoft Theater, they love you. What's there, up? How do, we start, how do we start talking about culos, eh? I know. <laughs> I know. Sorry for anyone who was eating uh, while watching was, this. Anybody who was eating um, birria right now. Right. <laughs> Or capirotada. Oh, bad. Oh, bad. Menudo. Menudo, pozole. Hey, uh, Felipe Esparza, who are the three most important people in your life? I was with my wife or mom and dad, I guess. Mom and dad? Yeah. Mom and dad hung in there even with your troubled past? I won't say hung in there, you know. She was there, but I, don't, I was, um, yeah, I guess. Yeah. Uh -huh. It's tough to talk about. I know, man. Why no, but I don't, I'm more like, I don't really go home a lot, you know? Yeah. Why not? Well, you're busy. I, you're you're always. I'm always out of town. Yeah. You know, they have their lives. Yeah, mm -hmm. man, absolutely. Microsoft Theater, you gotta catch uh, Felipe Esparza on stage. Yes. Funny. What's Rasa. up, fool? I'm coming up, with a new jokes, bro. Uh -huh. That's it's right. Funny. You've been working on a new. I set, hope people right? show up, man. I was in. Um, that's where I met the DJ right here. Is that it? DJ Leslie. DJ Leslie. 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 Yeah. I met her in DC, I bro. I told Felipe her name a good he thousand times. Me on and then he's like, hey, DJ, DJ what's Leslie. up? <laughs> DJ he, Leslie. He, he said DJ. I thought he said DJ Liz at first. It sounded like he said Liz. I was going to say easily. Uh -huh. <laughs> I was going to say just enough to correct me and I say it with you. Like, yes. yes. <laughs> it's all good. That's it's right. Like, no, so yeah, we. we bro, I did a show with her. In, in D.C., right? Now, we're, we're all going to hang out. Yeah. Uh, myself, Johnny Rocket, her, yeah. Gina Brion, another comedian. Okay, okay, okay. okay. And I don't know if Eric Rivera was there, but another comedian is right. And my friend, who went up before we was kind of offensive to some people, you know, because he did, like, some jokes. And then when I went Why up. Why you look at Eric? <laughs> no, no, I'm just looking around at the camera right here. No. Oh, okay. <laughs> no, he was offensive, you know, sexually. And then I did my jokes, you know, with the normal jokes, the, the same jokes I'm going to do at the Microsoft. <laughs> sure. But I don't know if you had a bodyguard with you at all times for some reason. Was it like a security guard yeah, watching you? Yeah. Well, my security guard was in charge of all the security guards uh -huh. that were in charge of your security and Gina's and everybody. So I get off the stage. Hey, we got to go to the back. You guys are offended some people, man. They want you guys to clear out of here. What? Uh -oh. So they can't clear us all like we were Bill Clinton or President Obama. <laughs> Trump, you know, or President Obama. Obama. He pretty much got us together and rushed us out to the elevator. What happened? And then some people were trying to get photos. No, we got to go. And I said, we, we don't know who they are. And I said, dude, did you, did you want to take a photo? I mean, how offensive it was. Yeah, I, like, what did well, I say? I, bro. I have no idea to this day, dude. Yeah. Oh, really? You don't need So anyone? later on, I saw them. What happened? Too good to hang out. Hey, man, we got rushed out of here. That's no, so weird, man. You were eating vegan food, too. We, we I, went to have steak, and you said you guys went They were eating food. lechon, good right, stuff. Right, 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 right. Leslie had a bodyguard out there. That's, That's right, crazy. Leslie. Yeah, roll sometimes. That's right. That's she right. big time. I know yeah. you like your bodyguarded, my G. <laughs> yeah, man. So I went back this way. I went to do the Arlington Draft House. Mm -hmm. And like a, they play like an actual movie theater during the day. Yeah. And they serve beer, and you can eat, have a pitcher of beer and watch movies. But the front row, they're like for movies, you know, to sit down like this. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. So nobody sits in the front row. And I didn't know that. Right? So I'm like bummed out because the whole front row is empty and uh -huh. the people are in the back. Yeah. And I said, damn, man, I guess 50 cents bought out the front row again. <laughs> <laughs> Fool, the crowd went crazy, man. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. I hope you don't know lot, 50 cent money, man. A lot of Salvadorians in, in um, D.C. Oh, really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. there's shoppies out there? For, yeah. uh, for the first time in my life, I saw a commercial with all Salvadorians in a commercial, oh, no the commercial, the car commercial. They coming up, they yeah. coming in up. Virginia. Right. It's Latino, Don't believe man. the hype, man. Whenever you hear the news about Salvadorians, yeah. they're on the come up, bro. You gotta go to the right places. Right, right, right. I don't understand why Mexicans and Salvadorians can't necessarily see Soccer, bro. Is it soccer? Soccer. <laughs> it's soccer's fault? Soccer and because Salvadorian names, sometimes Salvadorian names are very Americanized names. Like you can have a, a Salvadorian name, Jermaine, Brian, Brian's a big Courtney. One, yeah. You know, Melissa. Yes. 
And me Mexican, we have names that when you hear our names, you know they're making, they're doing something bad. Like, what's your name? Chema. Chema. Asesino. Chema. Sicario. <laughs> Canuto. Canuto. Hortensia. Porfilio. Porfilio. <laughs> Microsoft Theater Friday October Memo 4th. Tickets are on sale now Pelayo Wednesday, Memo <laughs> Yo again And the uh, What's Up Food Podcast You gotta check that Microsoft Theater Friday October 4th Again tickets are on sale uh, You can be Salvadorian Mexican White Asian Por favor No hable los Salvadorian Así por favor Porque la gran Tú sabes Right 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 You already know bro But no the, uh, Felipe Esparza is on stage You're on fire man uh, Dodgers World Series what, What's what's gonna happen there What do you think What's gonna happen bro That we're, we're all Gonna, we're all gonna um, get our hopes and dreams don't say crushed it. again, bro. Don't say it. No, we're not, that? dog. Listen, I'm just kidding, man. I don't Felipe, know, man. Felipe, we saw. I, I, a we're gonna win the World this. Series. You know why, man? Because I'm not going, bro. Every time I go to a game, they lose. I Is swear right? to God. Stay yeah. home, dog. Okay, yeah. then. So, and I went to I went to all the playoffs when they when when, when I was in Game Five with George Lopez. That game that went oh, forever, that. and yeah, they yeah, yeah. lost, bro. <laughs> I got back home and George they locked again. Luck, After that, bro, they gave me a cub hat, bro, like the guy that fucking uh -huh. cut that ball. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm not going to the World Series. Oh, no. I'm not going to the playoffs. But okay, they're going to well, win, bro. You don't need me, bro. Well-known Cub fan Felipe Esparza is at the Microsoft Theater yeah, Friday, October fan. 4th, man. Uh, bro, thank you so much for stopping by. We love you Thanks here. Thanks for man. having me, man. All man. day, bro. All day. <laughs> Let's get it. What's up, fool? What's up, fool? Microsoft Theater Microsoft Friday, Theater. October 4th. Tickets on sale now. Yeah, man. I'll be there with um, them, um, Tropa Magica. They're going to open up the show. Oh, is that right? Yeah. Oh, amazing. It's going to be a good show, man. Hell yeah. It's Tropa Magica, is that, are they musicians? Or? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. They used to be called the uh, Highland Grounds. Okay. Okay. My La guy. Tropa Magica. Thank you, bro. Appreciate Uy, it, man. Pongo. Felipe Esparza, Cruz Show, Real 92.3. Real 92.3.